A gas station beat down involving two men accused of shoplifting and the store clerk who tried to stop them. Surveillance video showing one of them tried to get away with a case of beer. He doesn't get very far. Local 10 News reporter Todd Tonkin live to show us what happened next. Todd. Well, this went from a shoplifting case to a robbery case, and this, uh, the police are looking for two felons now. It escalated so quickly. The good news is, is that that clerk is going to be all right, just suffered some minor injuries, and the surveillance video is extremely detailed. The video starts off innocent enough. A man grabs a 12-pack of beer from the cooler, but when it's time to pay, he takes off. That's when the 22-year-old cashier Antonio Vasquez chases after him, and the thief and his accomplice make a stand and fight the young man. Miami-Dade police say Vasquez should not have pursued those thieves. He did have minor injuries. However, we would never advise anyone to ever pursue a subject. As the two men tag team fight the victim, the man who stole the 12 pack probably wishes he had stolen a belt because his pants keep falling down. And police say what started as a simple shoplifting misdemeanor is now a felony. Since a physical altercation did occur over the property, the subject is now wanted for robbery. Police believe the thieves may live in the area of the Sitco gas station at Northwest 103rd Street and Northwest 12th Avenue because they were seen inside the store earlier. Eventually, they grab the beer and bolt. The clerk is battered and bruised and still loses the beer. Certainly not worth it at this point. It's a 12 pack of beer. Um, he could have been seriously injured. Now that clerk doesn't even work at this gas station any longer. He is fine, but he didn't want to go on camera and talk. Said he still is fearful because those guys are still out there. And Miami-Dade police want to know if you recognize them. If you do, call Broward, or rather Miami-Dade County Crime Stoppers at 305-471-TIPS. In Northeast Miami-Dade, Todd Tonga, Local 10 News.